Yo, what is up you guys? It's your boy Fusion Toby back in here with yes another video. I'm in the car. This is gonna be a vlog uh slash review type video. I'm in the car and I actually just yesterday had got um this game right here. It's been out for a while. Breath of the Wild, you can see I'm kind of dying right now. But I've been playing this. I do have a lot of things to say about this game. Some bad, some good. Um but This is going to be another video, a different video, um, but I sold the cards, I had to, y'all know why, y'all saw the video on the channel, I sold my cards, uh, I got 200 for them, yeah, I know, 200, the other place is going to give me 166, that $40 difference is going to make a lot of difference for me, so that $200 difference is a lot, so, um, that's going to be a whole different video, I guess. I might make a different video on it. I don't know yet, but I wish I could have took a picture of them. I should have. I'm going to do car videos again one day, but I'm not too sure. Maybe when Eclipse, uh, Solar Eclipse comes out or Color Eclipse. I can't remember the name. See, I don't even remember the name. But um, I'm going to do, I might do a walkthrough on... Uh, Breath of the Wild, this is the first time I'm playing this game, so let me know after the review, let me know down below if y'all want to see me play this game along with Link's Awakening, uh, just let me know and I'll see what I can do, I just wanted to play through it because I know a lot of y'all wanted to know about the motion controls and stuff, and let me tell y'all right now, y'all might be surprised when I say what I'm going to say about the Switch Lite version of Breath of the Wild. So, let's go ahead, let's jump right into it, um, I'm gonna have to do it when I get back home, I'm out with my mom right now, she's door dashing and stuff, so, I'll do it as soon as I get back home, and I'll see y'all guys in just Alright guys, uh, so I'm back at the house, and I just wanna do a review on this game right here, uh, first, some things that are in this video will be in a different video, uh, I've been playing this since I woke up this morning around 10, and it's actually, it's about to be 1 o'clock, so maybe 3, maybe 4 hours I've been playing this game. It's it's actually really good. Um, I've really been enjoying it. Uh, the only issue is motion controls. I'll be doing it in a separate video. I... I, like I said, a lot of things that are going to be in this video will be in that video. Uh, one thing is, turn off motion controls. I was sitting there in the car playing in handheld mode because it's a Switch light. And when I was trying to mark uh, shrines on the map, it was just moving without me even moving the, the uh, Switch itself. So turn those off. Um, other than that, it's a really good game. You can use sticks you can use axes uh torches anything like that to hit uh enemies you pick up weapons like sticks you just pick them up uh one another thing is when you first get out the your shrine the one that you wake up from make sure to check those two chests i didn't even realize they were there until i went back and got them and another thing is when you go to talk to the, to the old man Go ahead and uh, ask him to give you the the glide, the glider. Go ahead and ask him to give that to you because I didn't do that. And now I'm going to restart my game. Not only for you guys, but for me, myself. Because now I'm having to do a, a different journey that I wasn't going to have to do initially. And now I'm totally lost in the game. It's such an open world map that I got lost. I was all the way in the snowy biome and I kept dying because you can't go there without I guess a jacket or a hoodie or whatever some fur coat or something like that but other than that the game is really good um, I've been playing it all morning long on the Switch Lite it looks amazing um, the motion controls you do have to turn off like I said it's going to be in a different video because it's just kind of it's kind of weird. I don't know how to explain it, but it's kind of weird because it's meant to be played on the Switch, not the Switch Lite. 
but the Switch Lite does have the motion controls where you look and stuff, just like on Pokemon Go, or Pokemon Let's Go, and it's just totally different. I don't know anything about the Amiibos yet because I don't have any Zelda Amiibos at all, so I can't wait to test that out. Um, I will be doing some gameplay on it. Um, I'm going to do the motion control videos because I know somebody really wanted me to do that, and um, I told you I was. That's probably going to be Wednesday's video. This is going to be the second upload for today because I wanted to get a Breath of the Wild one out there because I've been playing Link's Awakening and now I have Breath of the Wild. So, two Zelda games on the Switch. I got both of them, man, and I'm loving them. Uh, I used to play Zelda on the GameCube, but that was when I was like seven or something, and I'm 18 now. So, it's been quite a while, it's been over 11 years. So it's been a while since I played a GameCube game in general. So um, I'm gonna be doing other videos on Breath of the Wild since I have it now. Uh, motion controls, gameplay, and does it in general does it suck on the Switch Lite? And are the graphics any better? That's going to be in this video. So yes, the graphics look to me way better. This is my honest opinion. The graphics look better. The gameplay looks better. The overall motion control. They're not good on the Switch Lite like they are on Switch. I haven't played it on the regular Switch dock mode. I haven't played a Switch game in dock mode since I got a Switch again, to be honest with you guys. I don't think... I mean, I tried doing a Mario Odyssey on it when I had it, which that is a game I would actually have to get back now because I, I sold it to get Pokemon cards. And... Um, this will be in a different update, but I did sell them, and these will be the only two current cards I have from Hidden Fates Love. I didn't want to sell these because I know they wouldn't give me that much for them, so. I will be doing card videos once again, maybe in the near future, hopefully. But, uh, this is just going to be a short video, um, about Breath of the Wild, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. It is a one-player game, if you know that, then you know it now, um, you defend the legend, you know, answer the call, um, the shadow of Calamity Gainar rises over the ashes of Hyrule, uh, craft your survival, you craft stuff, I haven't got to that yet, I just actually started the game, and now I'm actually restarting the game, just like I did on Link's Awakening for you guys, so hopefully, um, I'll have my gameplay, and then I'll have the video gameplay. My gameplay is simply just so I know what I'm doing. I'm getting the gist of, like, the feel of it. And the video gameplay is just going to be through the parts. I'll probably do four parts and see how that goes. And if y'all like it, then let me know in the comments on the video. And if you want to see more, I'll do more. Uh, I still got to finish Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Um, and I... That's about it because these are, I only have four games at the moment I'll probably do another video on this so these are the only four games I got right now I would have five but you know, I took them and sold them for Pokemon cards so it's whatever I guess but make sure y'all drop a like on this video make sure you subscribe if you're new and if you're new comment down below and tell me how you found my channel I'm actually really curious Anybody that's subscribed to the channel, if you're watching this video, let me know down below in the comment section how you found my channel. Was it A, recommended, B, you looked it up by any chance, um, C, you came across it while looking up a certain video, or D, a friend told you, which is actually really good, which reminds me, if you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and share this with your friends and family. Let me get out there. I'm actually two subs away from hitting 50. And I told y'all guys what's going to happen when I get to 50. At least before November. Or I might even switch it up and make it until 60. And see if y'all guys can reach that. Because if we can hit 100. If we can hit 100. I have some common and, uh, common and uncommon cards from the Hidden Fate set. So if y'all guys... You want to get me to 100 i'll give those away but thank y'all guys for watching the video uh this has been my review on legend of zelda breath of the wild and 
overall, it's a really good game. I enjoy it. I didn't think I was going to like it. But I was, I was wrong. So, I'll see y'all guys in the next one. Make sure y'all do drop a like and comment down below. And subscribe if you're new. Hit the post notification button. And I'll see y'all guys in the next one. Peace.